Welcome to Synchronize. Today, we'll go over managing expiring links. After sending out a link, you have the option to review who has been sent a link, how long the links can be accessed, and when the links will expire. For steps on sending links, see our video, Sending an Individual or Multiple Links. To manage links that have been sent to your project, click on the Actions tab and click on Expiring Links. Here, you can see all the links you've sent out, the date, the file name, the recipient's name, the recipient's email, along with other information we'll discuss in this video. Clicking on the actual file link will take you to the file. To see details about the link, click on the name of the recipient. The details page will show all of the security options you chose when you sent out the link. If the link is still active, it will show the expiration date and time. If the link is expired, that information will be reflected here as well. In the viewing history, you can see how many times the link has been accessed and from what IP address or mobile device. If needed, you can expire the link early. Please note, there is no additional information once you click Expire Link. It is immediately expired. Once the link is expired, the recipient will no longer be able to access information. The link expires at the time you set it to expire, regardless of the time zone. You can also show links sent by other users. Click the blue ellipsis in the sender column, click Show All in the filter field window, and your view will change showing all links sent by all users. The ellipsis buttons next to each field header will filter by that field. Filter fields include recipient name, email address, maximum views, and if the sent link has been locked to only be viewed on one device. And that's managing your expiring links and synchronize. Thanks for watching.